Today I want to show you how to take a picture and flip it. And I'm going to show you this one specifically. See how the alligator has its mouth open and it's pointing one way? Well, I was making some index cards for my third grade class and I wanted to show them comparing. And a lot of times when kids are younger, you say, wouldn't the alligator opens up his big mouth? That goes to the big number. Well, I couldn't find one pointing the other way. So I went into my trusted Canva account and found out that I can do that. And it was so exciting. So I'm going to show you how to do that today. Let's head over to Canva. I want you to type in www.canva.com. And when you get in there, you're going to hit create a design. Now, what I'm doing is I'm designing some cards in text, uh, helper cards for my students, as I, I told you earlier, and I'm just making them seven by five, the size of a large index card. So the parent can print them off and put them right into the box. This is my custom size. Um, so I say seven by five, I've already done it. I wanted to show you right here, this was the end result of what I made. These little alligators, like I said, I could only have him face this way when I found him online. All right, let's go back to the one we're creating. I uploaded my picture and I'm gonna get that for you again. And I just put him up here. Now, how did I get it to flip? See right here, once I put the um, picture in there, there's the word up here, it comes up. You can edit the image, you can crop it, or you can flip it. So you just click that and you can flip it vertically or horizontally. Look at that. I've got the same picture and it flipped horizontally. Now, again, you could also flip it upside down. We want it to go horizontal. It's that easy. Now we're gonna flip it back and horizontal. Now, to bring in both thick pictures on the same screen, I just brought the other one back. It's that easy. All right, I'm going to do it again. I'm going to go from scratch. Let's say that you have a picture of a person that you want to put on here. You know, when you're making a thumbnail, sometimes um, maybe you took a picture of yourself, but you're not quite facing the right way and you want to flip it. Let's go find a picture of a person. We're going to go up. I'm going to find, I'm going to find a picture of a person and I'm just going to flip it, give the mirror image. Maybe you're making a, maybe you're making a YouTube thumbnail and you just happen to want the picture with the person looking to the right instead of the left. It could be various reasons. This could be a good background picture. I went to a site called Pexels, P-E-X-E-L-S, and you can get free photos and you can just go in and download the one that you want. I'm going to go ahead and download this one. I'm going to stop the video and do it um, without um, wasting your time, but we're going to go ahead and take this one here and then I'm going to upload it to Canva and then we're going to flip it. OK, I downloaded my picture. It's on my desktop. So I'm back into Canva. I'm just going to add a page here. I'm going to upload my photo and we're going to bring it in and the photo will come out just the way you saw it in Pexels. And it was called Girl. You can see right here it's still downloading, but you can still click it. It will pop up over here on your page. And already at the top, it says crop or flip. We're going to flip it and we're going to um, flip it horizontally. And as you can see, she shows up on the other side. That's it. It's that easy. So for some reason, like I said, you might want, uh, you might even want a dual picture um, where you have both of them looking at each other where it looks like twins. But there you go. You have a, your a go to Canva. There's a free trial right below where you can go ahead and use all these uh, uh, and there you go. That's it. Easy peasy. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you get to use this lots and lots. I know I will. Uh, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Let me know how you like the video and I'll see you on the next.